Radical Sustainability Made Easy. One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 470. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do-it-yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. My name is Jay Sable and I'm the Executive Director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. One Community is bringing together the people with the consciousness and the desire for the highest good of all life on this planet to build sustainable and self-replicating teacher demonstration hubs as a pathway to global sustainability. This is our March 27, 2022 edition of our weekly progress update, and today's topic is radical sustainability made easy. And before we talk about radical sustainability, first we got to understand that from our perspective, when we say radical sustainability, we talk about the complete sustainable options available covering all aspects, physical foundations of sustainability, as well as the emotional foundations of sustainability to create comprehensive sustainability that will cover all aspects of life and lead to a completely sustainable civilization. And so when we talk about physical and emotional foundations of sustainability, we break that down in those two categories because the physical foundations of sustainability are what most people already know about. So radical sustainability made easy, obviously should include the physical foundations, which everybody knows about, their food, energy, and housing. But we also add to that the emotional foundations of sustainability, which we've identified as and call highest good approaches to fulfilled living, highest good approaches to education, highest good approaches to economics, and highest and true earth stewardship, or highest good approaches to all aspects of living and stewarding our planet. And putting these things all together as a comprehensive approach to sustainability that includes everything that you see in the background, happening in the background of this video, and so much more, so much more than that. So radical sustainability made easy from our perspective is taking all those things, the physical foundations, the emotional foundations of sustainability, and putting them together in community models so that people can cooperate and collaborate on radical sustainability to improve efficiency and to demonstrate the radical unsustainability and inefficiency of the everyone for themselves paradigm by demonstrating something better. By showing that through cooperation and collaboration, we can build houses that are artistic and beautiful and will last longer than traditional houses, that we can create 100% renewable energy, sustainable energy that will reduce the cost of living for us and eliminate those bills, so that we can grow food that is more diverse than what you can get in the grocery store and that is healthier. It doesn't have you know, poison sprayed on it. It doesn't have any herbicides, pesticides, or fungicides, and it's fresher. It's locally grown. You can pick it fresh and eat it right off the vine. You know, so that we can create environments that are socially and recreationally more enriching and more supportive of the human experience and our soul and our happiness, our overall happiness. So that we can create highest good approaches to education models that teach people not what to learn, but how to learn. That expand the paradigm and the idea of what education is about so that we are creative, out-of-the-box thinkers, and so that we are, are more apt to innovate and, and free of, I would say, the limitations of the traditional paradigm, you know, so that children are, again, taught how to learn instead of specifically what to learn. Of course, we cover all the different subjects, but you have to see our education program to really understand the details of that. Check it out. So we can demonstrate high good approaches to economics, you know, so radical sustainability made easy obviously needs to meet people's financial needs as well. And so our model is, is demonstrating a resource-based economy as well as nonprofit and for-profit uh, approaches as well to economics so that people have all those options. And of course, stewardship, you know, showing how to not just take, not just to live within our environments, but to live in a way that contributes to our environments and makes those environments better, that gives those environments, stewards those environments, creates and builds biodiversity, creates and builds ecosystems and enriches ecosystems and establishes new ecosystems so that they are permanent, like food forests and things of that nature. You know, and putting all this together to demonstrate that by combining all these things, we can better meet the needs of, the way, of people than the way that they're living right now. And if we can make this easy enough, affordable enough, and demonstrate as attractive enough, then the idea will spread its own. And so this idea of radical sustainability made easy really culminates in the idea of producing an environment that is just more fun to live in than the way that people are living right now. And it costs less, 
it eliminates helps people eliminate their debt and free themselves from from uh, the thumb of, of economic instability and insufficiency it creates an environment that is abundant that is constantly contributing more than it takes you know a net zero carbon negative environment that is supporting people on the individual level supporting people on the community level supporting people on the on the county and regional level supporting globally and supporting people globally you know working with tribe family humanity to work to create a world that works for everybody and demonstrating again easy enough affordable enough and attractive enough demonstrating that by living this way not only do we get to give back not only do we get to make a difference but the environment the experience of living within the environment is better than the way people are living right now because there's more things to do and more free time to do those things. So when I say more things to do, like what do I mean specifically by that? The idea of living in community and the model that we've designed is that everybody contributes that wants to, contributes a few hours a week to something that they truly love, like sharing their gift, sharing their passion with other people that are interested in participating with that so that there's always you know, a pickup game of basketball going on, or soccer, or painting class, or reading, or uh, debate, or maybe a nature walk, or spending time with our kids, or a picnic, those kinds of things. Whatever it is that people are passionate about and sharing that with the community as an open source, a free shared, and a collaborative, like, hey, let's get together and do this because we enjoy doing it. So who else wants to come and play a game? You know, who else likes board games? Who else would like to watch a movie and talk about it? You know, who else would like to watch a movie and just relax? You know, who would like to debate the news topics of the day? You know, and creating those kinds of opportunities with the environment so that it is a rich and thriving environment. Who wants to do yoga? Who wants to work out? You know, who wants to go, like I said, on a nature walk or who wants to go and explore some new regional thing? You know, those kinds of things are all incorporated within the community model. And everything, for the most part, is within walking distance and free to provide an environment that is like a club med or a vacation type of environment that people would typically pay to go and experience. But it is the living environment that we're creating. And so we talk about radical sustainability made easy. We talk about taking the physical foundations of sustainability, the food, the energy and housing, and establishing those such that it lasts longer, provides a way of living that is cheaper, more affordable than people are used to, and then combining that with the emotional foundations of sustainability to, to, to cater to our souls, to cater to our, our deeper needs, our needs of connection and variety and growth and community and and socialization and recreation and making that easy enough affordable enough and attractive enough so that it spreads on its own we're open sourcing and free sharing all the aspects of that so that anybody that wants to participate can and so that people that have a better idea and would like to take what we do what we're doing and do it differently can and demonstrating again how much more efficient and enjoyable it is than the everyone for themselves paradigm that most people are living right now. This is how one community is working towards a world that works for everybody. And this is how we see a planet that works for everybody within our lifetime by creating a self-replicating model built on this. Radical sustainability made easy enough, affordable enough, and attractive enough. And that foundation so that people want to create this and so the idea can spread virally around the world and then working in cooperation and collaboration with everybody that wants to live this way and evolve living this way and spread living this way so that we can make it accessible to anybody who wants to. And reaching that critical mass, that tipping point of participation so that it touches the lives of every single person on this planet in some way, shape or form, if for no other reason than by helping clean up our environment through the stewardship component, things like that, creating more beautiful places that other people can participate in, but really creating a place where anybody who wants to participate and be a part of this can come and do that. All it requires is a desire, you know, to want to participate and a willingness to help create it. This is what one community is doing. So if you like the idea of, of uh, hearing good news like this and forward thinking vision like this, like and subscribe. Ring that bell if you'd like to get this in your inbox every single week. I talk about a different topic. Um, if you'd like to see details, specifics about all the open source plans, everything we're creating, specifics of what we com completed just in the last week, visit our written blog or visit our website if you'd like to see all the open source tools and resources and plans. And if you'd like to help, contribute, um, get involved, visit our helping page. And of course, if you'd like to see bullet points on all the major components of our project, uh, stick around for another minute or so, and we'll cover that as well. So with that said, thanks for following our progress. Watch until the end. And of course, until next week, we will keep on keeping on. Thank you.
The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. The next component is Highest Good Education. This component is complete and pretty much ready to launch once we're on the property. One community's approach to Highest Good Education is designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, includes national standards, all subjects, lesson plans, teaching strategies, learning strategies and tools, classroom design, and more. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet.